Welcome to this edition of Dwyer Tech and Specs. In this video, I will cover custom vanes on the V4 vane operated flow switch. Vane or paddle flow switches are used to initiate high or low flow alarms. A common application is as a low flow alarm for shutdown of a system for protection of the components from damage. Often these are used in cooling lines, oil lines, or monitoring other fluid flows that are critical for the system to operate. In the example shown, a V4 is used to ensure cooling water circulation before the air conditioning compressor motor starts. The V4 flow switch comes standard with a universal vane that has five adjustable layers for field setting the actuation and deactuation flow set point. The universal vane works in one and a half to 20 inch pipe sizes for fluid or gas applications. Our catalog page and instruction manual show the approximate actuation and deactuation rates according to fluid, pipe size, and vane layer selected. The actuation point is where the switch changes state on an increase of flow, and the deactuation point is where the switch resets to the normal state. If the universal vane does not have the proper actuation and deactuation point needed for your application, then Dwyer can fabricate a custom vane for your specific application needs that can usually be made in about two weeks. The custom vane is made with a specific surface area to actuate or deactuate according to the flow rates you specify. Dwyer can also make it out of a variety of materials according to the chemical compatibility needs. A custom vane model can be ordered by contacting Dwyer Technical Sales or ordered directly on our website using the V4 product configurator. Just select the custom vane option and fill in the needed criteria in the pop-up box. You will need to know the pipe size, the fluid and specific gravity, the flow rate unit of measure, the activation flow rate, the deactuation flow rate, which flow rate is critical, the maximum flow rate, and the normal flow rate. Dwyer needs to know if the actuation or deactuation flow rate is critical based on only being able to ensure that one flow rate is met. If it is a low flow alarm, then select the deactuation flow rate. And if it is a high flow alarm, then select the actuation flow rate. Typically, the deactuation point is approximately 55% of the actuation point for liquids and 75 to 90% of the actuation point for gases. Dwyer can make V4 custom vanes that will actuate on increasing flow or deactuate on decreasing flow according to the velocity ranges on the chart shown. Don't forget to check back weekly for regular editions of Dwyer Tech and Specs. Dwyer Instruments, right choice, right price, right now.